Do you know what time it is? Looks like it's time to go back to school. Hi everyone, my name is Matthias Maurer and I'm busy training for my upcoming mission to the International Space Station. This September, ESA Education goes back to school with five school projects for primary and secondary school students. Let's have a look at them. In the European Astropy Challenge, you'll have the chance to conduct your own specific experiment in space by writing a computer program that will run on the Raspberry Pi computers on board with me on the International Space Station. Never coded before? No problem! You can get started with Mission Zero, an entry-level challenge for beginners. This year you will have the special mission of naming the new Astropies. Mission Space Lab, on the other hand, will open the door to a whole new world of experiment possibilities, thanks to the new sensors and cameras. We astronauts on the International Space Station have a unique and amazing perspective of our planet. Seeing Earth from space reminds us how important our planet is and that we must protect it. The Climate Detectives Project is our chance to help ESA understand and protect our planet's environment. You'll be challenged to make a difference by investigating a local climate problem using real satellite data and your own measurements. In the end, you share your results with the Climate Detectives community as a real scientist. Next up is Moon Camp. Accept the challenge to 3D design a habitat on the lunar surface. Develop experiments to explore the extreme environment of the Moon and understand how astronauts could live there. And then use your knowledge to design your very own 3D Moon Camp using Tinkercad or Fusion 360. Don't forget to adapt your design to the Moon environment. Consider the use of local resources and provide protection of living and working facilities for the astronauts. This challenge is open to beginners and advanced participants. Choose between three categories featuring different levels of complexity. The Moon Camp Discovery, Moon Camp Explorers and Moon Camp Pioneers. With CANSAT you'll imagine, build and test your very own mini satellite fitting the size of a soda can. Then your CANSAT will be launched by a small rocket up to an altitude of one kilometer where it can complete its scientific mission. A primary mission will consist of measuring temperature and pressure and a secondary mission that is up to your own imagination. If you are completely new, the CANSAT Beginners Challenge will allow you to understand the basics of CANSAT by measuring temperature using Tinkercad circuits. Last but not least, there's Mission X, where you are there to get up, move your body and train like an astronaut. You'll complete fun science and physical activities to develop your fitness skills and explore how real astronauts train for missions to space, from what we eat to how we keep our muscles and bones healthy. Earn points for each activity you complete to help the Mission X mascots, Luna and Leo, walk to the moon. For teachers who are curious to discover more about space, ESA is also running online teacher trainings during the school year. The workshops will explore how space technology and the study of our home planet from above can be used in the classroom in an inspiring and innovative way. You can find information about all the school projects and teacher trainings and how to take part at the link below. I'll be following your progress all the way from the ISS. Time to pack your bags and to head back to school.